What up? It's your boy NWP, and I've been on the grind. So if you want to help, then you can hit that subscribe button and the notification bell just next to it so that you can get alerted anytime that I drop a new video. If you like this video at any time, hit the thumbs up, and if you have any comments, suggestions, or feedback, drop them in the box below. So, I've been grinding, and here it is. Hunt camo. Five headshot requirement. Nothing major, nothing much. It's not really one of the coolest camos you can get in the game by any means, but hey, it's something. Next up, we have the patrol camo, which actually, for only taking headshot, 10 headshots, is really cool looking. It's not amazing, but for a 10 headshot camo, pretty easy, pretty good looking. All right, now we have the panther camo. 15 headshots and definitely probably one of the ones you'll see people using even though it is a significantly low requirement so you can see here the panther camo is pretty cool purple and black obvious next up we've got monsoon kind of a just regular camo i don't know why it's called monsoon because it's really green it just looks like a jungle kind of like a jungle tech kind of camo but uh 20 headshots not really that bad now we got Agitator is up next at 30 headshots, and this is a bad looking uh, like sand camo, but it's definitely a rattlesnake, so you can tell why it's called Agitator. And uh, yeah, I don't think we'll be seeing it that often, to be honest, though. Next up is URD at 40 headshots, and uh, again, just kind of like your uh, Middle Eastern sand camo kind of setup. Nothing really amazing. Uh, maybe a little bit more jungle-esque. But now we have Bengal, which is, oddly enough, a tiger, which we'll get into that. But 50 headshots, definitely not the hardest of ones to come by, so it's all right. As you can see, it's, it's you know, eh, it's all right. I actually like this upcoming one right here, Massacre, at 50 headshots, or 75 headshots, excuse me. This one I like all red, looks great. I think it's pretty dope. <clears throat> then following that, we have Red Tiger at 100, which will unlock your, you know, next challenge-based uh, camouflages for your weaponry. And uh, I think that one looks all right, but eh. It's not, I've never really been a biggest fan of the Red Tiger. Now, Roller Rink is the one we have up next, and this is probably the hardest one to me. The long shot medals, there's just, like, nowhere to get long shots, so, except in, like, the map Militia. But, you know, this is kind of your wild 80s theme. We see this in every Call of Duty, so. But here is Mother of Pearl, and this one is 50 kills without any attachments on your weapon. It's all right. It's kind of looks, I think, like, the, the textured look to it actually kind of looks bad, so, eh. It doesn't really look like Pearl. Purple Hex will be the next one we get here. And this is uh, 50 kills with five attachments and an optic on your gun. Uh, pretty easy to get, to be honest. Not that cool of a camo. Next up was, though, is probably one of my favorite. And that is Penthouse. Or the Gucci Gun, Gucci Gun, Gucci Gun. And this takes two rapid kills five times. So, double killer. Or, you know, whatever the thing is, what it's called, the double kill, double killer challenge. And finally, one that everybody remembers, Spectrum. This was highly sought after, you know, back in the day in Ghosts. And this takes five kills without dying five times. So, just, you know, a little kill streak. Which leads us up to the piece de la resistance. And that is the gold. Gold? Does it? No, this looks like poop. And that's unlocking all of their camos, as seen before. Obviously, you know this. But, uh, yeah, here you go. You take a look at it. I'll shoot it and reload it so you can see what it looks like. It sucks. It's ugly. It's probably the worst of any COD ever. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope to bring you more of these videos as I unlock the rest of them. Thanks for watching. Check out one of these other videos. And have a good day.